No, mm -hmm. I have it. You can you can open it. What's that? This is just tonic. We're just gonna, oh. we're gonna pour the. We're gonna make a gin and tonic. <laughs> oh, no. All right. Okay. Um, and also, I'm just holding a splintered <laughs> coffee stirrer because hey. I don't want to dirty a spoon stirring our drinks. So. Yeah, great. We're off to a hot here start here on Sobros Network. Uh, Stoney Keeley here it. with Brandon Vick. We are back to, you are shaking the camera, sir. Here. We are back to uh, talk about our friends there at Trouble Spirits. If you haven't heard us talking about them on Sobros Podcast over the course of the last three months, do yourself a favor, check them out, troublespirits.com. You can get the gin, you can get the vodka, you can get the whiskey there. Uh, we got us a bottle of the gin today. We'll do a close up. We tried this oh, with okay, the, yeah. the vodka Oh, okay, yeah, go ahead. See if you get. Oh, that's nice. That's a beautiful, that beautiful label. design on that bottle. It comes like equipped the color. with a, uh, an inspirational quote as well, if you would. Can Brandon. I read it? You can. The best revenge is massive success. There you go. Frank Sinatra. Frank Sinatra. So, with it being Gin Friday, and it being time oh. to celebrate life and wave at the haters, we thought there's no better time to bust open this bottle and uh, try ourselves a gin and tonic. I have never taken part in a gin Friday. I did really? not really. You know, I don't never. drink. I, full disclosure, I don't really drink gin. I've yeah. gone to Clear Liquor here lately. And, I was about to say, uh, I've, I've made you some gin cocktails no, no, I've had when a you've few. been over here. But, but was but, it on Friday? Was it on Friday? Exactly. That's the, that's the question, yeah. It smells like a good... You know more about gin than I do, but... It smells like something <clears throat> that doesn't get too out of line, doesn't try to be exotic. It smells like a nice, straightforward well, gin You know here. what? If it ain't broke. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. All right. All right. Cheers. Well, cheers to Gin Friday. Celebrate gin life Friday, and wave at the haters. Trouble spirits. That's strong. That's got a bite to it. I oh, might it does. need to... Oh, that's an interesting mm. flavor, though. I'm going to tell you. That's a good clean gin flavor. It's clean. Clean. I am not a gin and tonic kind of fella, but that I could drink. Mm. It's refreshing. That's my problem. I didn't fucking stir my drink enough. Oh, I'm sorry. I, um, Armstrong told me if you don't like curse <laughs> words in these videos, because I'll I'll edit that. Let me out. see. Maybe I don't know. Mine tastes mine tasted quite refreshing. Yeah, that's. I think sure I just I took. Right. I think my first sip was just straight gin. It's yeah. a shame. Like I usually have a lime on hand for gin and tonics, but you spritz a lime in that, and that's pretty damn good. That's pretty damn refreshing. I would drink. I would drink that. And I've and listen, if you think I'm BSing, I've tried some of gin and tonics that he's had, and I, I did not I, like them. You know what, man? I would put this. I think you put this in that category of the upper echelon of stuff like the the Hendrix gin, like. I, I feel don't like know anything about that. You don't know anything. Yeah. Okay. Well, this is a good straight That sounds like a big deal. <laughs> this is a good Well, a lot of people a lot of people go for Hendrix when they make their gin and tonics, but this is kind of like this is that same deal where it is like a basic straightforward gin. I don't think you're going to get any of the uh, like the outside the box botanicals in it, but it is kind of something that we know about trouble because we've reviewed the whiskey, uh, we've reviewed the vodka even though that film's not going to come out for another month, but it's something that like three liquors in, I think it's safe to say is synonymous with the Trouble Spirits brand. Is like you get that good, straightforward, clean, smooth. Every drink, everything I have tried, whiskey, the vodka, this gin has been smooth. Man, that's... and I'm not a gin person, and vodka isn't my first go-to either. But they are both really smooth. Doesn't, and doesn't, I like the word clean. It's a that's yeah. a that's a, I, that's a good way of, of describing. I would probably say all three, but yeah. this one is quite refreshing. Like you it said, is. I think throw a lime in there too; mm -hmm. it adds to it. But I could drink that. I could drink it just just like this. It doesn't it doesn't have the uh, the list of botanicals on the bottle, but I might have to I might have to ask. I don't know if that's like a. I mean, some companies like are super secretive hmm. about the the botanicals that they put in the gin but i think that is as good of a a drinking gin hmm. like you know if you're a fan of um aviation that's kind of what it Ooh, re reminds i know that me of. ryan reynolds ryan reynolds brand like probably the best drinking gin that there is i think you put trouble in that category i don't know i i should say this like this should be an option on the shelf of the gin section of every fucking liquor store in America. Well, Sorry, another listen from a guy who's been doing gin Fridays I, for years. That's a hell of an endorsement. I'm I'm pleasantly surprised. Maybe I shouldn't I shouldn't put this on air, uh, but you know, okay, you, you drink, but you're gonna. 
Well, you drink a lot of gin when you do what I do for Gin Friday. And there, there was a part of me that's like, mm. man, what happens if I don't like it? Like, can I, can I give yeah, it Yeah, well, that's with you? everything, yeah. But that's, that's fucking good. That passes the test. That's a, as good of a drinking gin as you'll find on the market. Isn't it nice to have right trouble there. as a friend? It is. It is nice. And I mean, they make good shit. <laughs> like, people, people that you trust doing good shit in the world that uh, make a damn good product that I stand by. Yep. I like it. They know that's, what they're doing. I haven't tried. We can officially say, which, spoiler alert on the vodka one, but I officially say they, they, they don't make a bad, a bad thing to sip on. No, not at all. Or to shot or chug. I don't know how people drink. Yeah. Well, we took shots of vodka, so... Yeah. Good job, Trouble. Thank you. You know, That's I don't refreshing. know if I have license to say this, but start harassing bars, Hell restaurants, yeah. start harassing liquor yeah. stores in your area to get the Trouble Spirits yeah. on your shelves. If you got to get violent, do it. If you got to get... We, uh, you know, unlike... <laughs> we do encourage violence here at Sobros Network, so... For... Delicious for, Spirits. For Delicious Spirits, which you can obtain with Trouble Spirits at TroubleSpirits.com. And, of course, be sure to follow mm. them at Trouble Spirits on all major social media platforms.